Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's Thursday the 17th of March and I am here for special edition afternoon notices at the inaugural Year 9 versus Year 10 football match right here on the AstroTurf in the sunshine. The scene is set, the spectators are starting to arrive and the Year 9s are beginning their warm-up. Reese, 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 come over. Oh, Reese, that was rubbish. Come over, come over. How are you feeling, Reese? I'm, fe I'm feeling confident, I'm not gonna lie. I was pretty nervous not earlier. Lie. You're feeling confident. What's gonna be the outcome this afternoon, Reese? Well, to be honest, I'll, I'll say what I said to everybody. Um, it's either gonna be a massive win to the Year 10s or a fairly simple win to us. And give, give me a score, give me a score. Uh, 2-0 year 9. 2-0 year 9. You, you heard it here first enough? from Reese. Ah, year 9 captain, Matthew Howarth. Hello, sir. Feeling good? <laughs> yeah. Give me a prediction for this afternoon, please. 5-0. 2-1. 2-1 for year 9. 2-1 year 9. Nine. Okay, so year 9's feeling confident. Good sir. How are you feeling, sir? Feeling confident for this afternoon? Very confident. Looking forward to a fair occasion. match. Great occasion. Uh, and you've been coaching the year 10s, is that right? Yeah. You've been coaching the year 10s. So are your team going to pull really? through for you? Definitely. Definitely. You're going to pull one over Mr. Bickman, yes? Easily. Excellent. Thank you very much, Mr. Collins. Do we have a referee in the house? We, we do. have a referee in the house. Tafari. Where's he gone? Tafari. This afternoon's yeah. referee. We're expecting a bit of a rough match this afternoon, Tafari. Is that right? Yep. What are you going to be looking out for? What's your standard? Um, I want a nice clean game, yeah? And then if I have to dish out any yellows, I will. Excellent. Yellows or reds? Let me see your cards. Let yeah, me see I your cards. cards. Right here. Yeah. Proper pro looking yeah. cards there from Safari. Thank you. Yeah. Good luck. Have a Thank good game. You. Thank you. Gregory and QB, give me a prediction for this afternoon. Are you playing QB? Yeah. Oh, good. I'm a contributor to the football team. Excellent. 3 1. 3 1 to year 9. Year 10. <laughs> Opening scorer? Louis Gregory. Louis Gregory. Excellent. So 3-1 to year 10. It's not going to be that shaky. Could go either way. It's not going to be that shaky. We've got a bit of division in the year 10 rank. Yeah. Uh, and year 9 are yeah. definitely yeah. sounding louder and more confident. Let's get it on! And the teams are coming out for the inaugural year 9 versus year 10 football match. Here come the year 9. Led by Captain Matthew Howard. Probably the favourites for this afternoon's match. Closely followed by the Year 10s, who are looking like a bit more of a rabble, if I'm honest. Not the organised, orderly ranks of Year 9. Year 10 coming across as a bit of a mob. But they look like they mean business. They're big. Year 10 are big. It's a shame it's not a rugby match. And there's Ivan. Hi. Now, as the teams warm up behind me, you can see Year 10 going for a little jog in red and Year 9 over there, they're kicking a ball around. You're going to learn an interesting fact about your Deputy Headmaster, which is I know not really the first thing about football. I don't get it. I know they're going to kick a ball around and these guys have got flags. That's about as far as it goes. So my commentary this afternoon is going to be a little bit amateur, but I hope that will bring some colour and some enjoyment to your life. The excitement's building. I'd say we're about five minutes away from kickoff now. Latest pundit in the studio is Mr. Carey. Mr. Carey. 3 0 year 9. 3 year 9, year, three nil year nine victory. First scorer? Oh, probably Yuri. Probably Yuri. You heard it here first from Mr. Carey. And a little known fact about Mr. Carey, come back, Mr. Carey, is that actually Mr. Carey does have psychic powers. <laughs> he does have psychic powers. And so actually, what you hear from Mr. Carey is likely to be correct. You can see it there. It's coming kind of emanating. Emanating. They will Psychic win. They, will, they win. will win. It's like the demon headmaster. Go. Okay, heads or tails? Heads. Right. Tails. Ah, oh, an opening victory for year 10 over year 9. Louis Gregory? Good. Good. What happens now? Do they get a point for that? They get kick off. They get kick off. Lovely. How do you feel about that, Matthew? Are you on a losing streak? You're on a losing streak now. You're going to win anyway. Okay, lovely. So, year 10 win the coin toss. They've gone into a huddle. And Mr. Bell's here. Hello, Mr. Bell. I asked your year 8 if they were playing, who would win? Year 8. No, they said year 10. Really? Yeah, more confidence. I'm rooting for year 10. mindset for year 8, please. I'm rooting for year 10. for year 10. Mr. Bell is team 10. Oh, is it? Oh! We're the founders, yeah? Yes. We'll kick them off this pitch. Founding people! Come on! 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 Come
When's the cricket season start? Never on camera! Behind me, players so about to get underway in the first ever 9 versus 10 inter year group soccer match here at Polyport College on a lovely Thursday afternoon. Are they playing? Somebody is going to kick the ball in a minute. Look, there's Lewis Quimbauer. I didn't think he could play football. I thought he only played rugby. Lewis, come here. Come here. You know, you know it's not rugby, don't you? You know it's not rugby, right? Yeah. You know you're not allowed to like hit anyone or throw anybody it's, upside down. It's, he said it's on board the board line. Okay. okay, on the board line. So, here we go. Here we go. They're going to start at some point soon. Someone's going to kick that football and the game will get underway at some point. Get on with it! And they're off! We're about five minutes in to the 9 versus 10 football match. It's nil-nil, and I'll be honest, nobody's even come close to scoring. They're all just kicking the ball backwards and forwards in the midfield. Um, it's lacking a bit of cut to edge at the moment, but we do have your 10 on the attack. It looks like they might have a corner. Should we go and see if we can get a bit closer to the action? So this is year 10 corner. Its corner's going to be taken by, I think that's George, but I'm really short-sighted, so I can't see. No, it's Louis. Okay, so Louis's going to take a corner. Oh, it's along the ground. It's in the box. And no, uh, year nine again. Oh, strong tackle from Louis Gregory on year nine. Not very gentlemanly, I have to say. I'm now here with Mrs. Da Costa, who is here to give us some expert punditry on this afternoon's action. Mrs. Da Costa. There has just been some great footwork, amazing Perfect. footwork, amazing great footwork. scoring. You know that thing about bad workmen and tools? Year 10, right? They're all just stood there, not even playing anymore. They're just going, sir, sir, the ball's flat. What did you just say, Dylan? Sir, the ball's flat. Yeah. Stop your moaning. Growth mindset, no excuses. Of course it is. Public spirited from Dylan. I am here with former Northern Ireland ladies under 17 goalkeeper Mrs Dawson who knew that Mrs Dawson was the former yeah. under under 17 Northern Ireland goalkeeper hidden talents Mrs. hidden Mrs. talents what made you such a good goalkeeper Mrs Dawson I'm quite tall for a girl. Quite tall quite for a girl. Tall, yeah, for a girl, are you being sexist? No, just I'm quite okay. tall. Biologically quite tall for a girl. Tall. And so tell me about the favourite save you ever made. Who were you playing? What happened? And tell me about that save. Um, well, you're a bit young. Golden Banks. All I can say is Golden Banks in the World Cup. Just tipping it I know, And that, that was the save you made, was it? No, that's, that's Okay, your favourite save. Like Act it out. Here comes the ball. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Save it, save it, save it. Oh, you missed the score! <laughs> Mrs. Dawson, she's obviously lost her touch now. She's no longer under 17. Gentlemen, stop the press. Hold on a minute, because Apple has something interesting to say. Uh, year nines are winning at the moment. No, they're not. No, they're they're not. not. Oh. Someone told me this one. Oh, oh, they're talking. Yeah, they so Apple has told me two lies. She told me she had something interesting to say, <laughs> and she told me that year nine were winning. Year nine aren't winning because Alejandro is here flirting yeah, with the ladies Alejandro rather than playing football. Alejandro told me that. Go play football. Yeah. Cola, no, the Cola told the lies. He told me. Jordan that. Green's here to offer me some insight. So what was it you just told me, John? Um, basically, I'm not on the year 10 team and I'm way too good for them all. That's right, right. And, year nine right. and we, we didn't want to embarrass the year 9 yeah. by putting Jordan Green in the team. What position would you be playing, John? Up striker, straight up there. Thank you, thank you, John. Well, I look forward to seeing it. Somewhere behind me over there, they're still kicking the ball around. My assumption is they're doing that because at some point somebody's going to try and put the ball in the goal, but they don't really seem to be trying very hard. And it's still nil-nil. There is another possibility here, of course, which is that they know we'd all really like to see a penalty shootout at the end of this match. So very possibly the reason they're doing such a bad job of putting the ball into the goal is because they would like to do a penalty shootout. We'd all like that very much indeed. The boys have stopped trying to kick the football into the goal, which they weren't doing very well, and now they're all having a cuddle. So I guess that means it's half time. Let's go and join the year 10 cuddle first of all. Here we go, we're heading towards the year 10 boys who, who frankly look like they haven't got a clue how they're going to score. Gentlemen, 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 what's the strategy here? Is no, it to keep no, them waiting no, no so comments, long that they get really no bored comments. and give up? No comments. No comments. We're, we're no comments. Out, okay, sir, I'm going to go and tire them out. Is that right? I'm going to go and see the year 9 cuddle over here. Gentlemen of year 9, where are we at? Because what I'm seeing at the minute is a lot of flouncing around, but nobody's actually managed to put the ball into the goal. And somebody told me that was the point. That's not the one aim of football, sir. Is it not? What That's is it you're trying to do? Win. Win? Yeah. What? So by... Can we just have a team? Yes, of course. I'll just, I'll just sit quietly here. Alright, alright. Let's squeeze him, yeah? Alright, yeah, one, right. one, two, three, squeeze, boys. One, two, three, squeeze! One, two, three, squeeze! One, two, three, squeeze! Come on, you! Yeah. <laughs> so, 
way the second half is underway. And thus far, it's fairly similar to the first half in that nobody has scored and not a right lot has happened. Oh, but, 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 is Osa? Oh, no, that's Osa passing it back to Jago. So, no, nothing happened again. Maybe something will happen soon. Uh, maybe not. Maybe we should all just stop and play rugby. More action taking place. Year 9 have a corner down the far end, I believe. Um, something might happen here, I suppose. Is he going to take that corner? Yeah. Oh, no. Never mind. I told you I didn't get this game. So there's another corner kick, and this time it is a corner, and it's a corner kick to your 10, and they've taken it short. Oh, uh, uh, it's in! I got it on camera! That's amazing! I actually got the goal on camera! I win! I win! I'm a legend! I'm an absolute legend! I got the goal on camera when they did it! Oh yes! Rockstar win! my excitement after that goal that I actually that was my win right because I got the goal on camera at the time it happened uh, I don't actually really know what happened Lewis talk to you right. a corner beautiful corner came off Ossa Louis brings it in shoots bottom left corner beautiful oh 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 there might be another one there Clear, clear by you. So, so, so who scored? Louis Gregory. Was it a good goal? It was a brilliant goal. Was it, was it a really brilliant goal? Silky. Excellent. Silky. I, I still haven't seen it because I was looking the other way, but it's on camera and you've just seen it. So winner for all posterity. Louis Gregory won the year 10. Let's see what happens. Yeah, we're into the closing minutes. Here. Year 10 on the attack again. Is it in? And I got it on camera again. QB. No, it's not. Year 10 celebrating wildly. It's 2 0 year 10. But, godlike genius award goes to Mr. McCary, who got both goals on camera. Have that. A brace for Sir. Boom! Kieran Solanke wants to be in it and he wants to do a dance. So here he is. Dab, dab, dab. Dab. What's that? It's a dance move. Is it? Yeah. I don't know. I'll do it again. Okay, one, two, three. What else I've just learned today, apart from year 10 being 2 0 up, and I uh, don't you run away. I've learned that Mr. Carey really doesn't like being wrong because he predicted what 3-1 to year 9 and it's currently 2-0 to year 10 so he was wrong and he keeps asking me not to put it in because he's embarrassed about it. I won't. Oh look the ball! It's still too early. Of course it's a little bit tired he's having a sit down. Oh no he's got up now. You can throw the ball now Edward. You can throw the ball now. Look Edward's going to throw the ball. Oh, 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 is this another year 10 attack? This could be the end of it here. This could be the end of it here. Cleared by year 9, but year 10 will have an attack and throw in. Andrew Passer with the ball. He's thrown it in and somebody's blown the whistle. Oh, foul throw. Lucas coming to take over. This could be the death knoll for year 9 already. 2 0 down. Ball's going to come into the box. Long throw from Lucas Padworth. Right to danger area. Headed out. Oh, it's in. It's in by Chester Johnson, is it? No, has it gone over the top? Oh, I got very overexcited, but he didn't score. But nice try, Chester. We Final like that. Seconds Thank of you. this match here. Year 9 on the attack again, looking for anything but year 10 break from defence. Goal scorer, Alex. To Andrew Passer. Across to Peter. Dying seconds of this match to QB. Interception by Osa. One final attack. Is that time? Is that time? Dying seconds. Down the wing for year 10. Into the middle. Oh, it's in. 3 0 year 10. Every goal on camera. That's the end. Wild celebrations from year 10. Year 9 going down the other end, but final whistle blows from Tafari. It's all over. Year 10 of the champions. 3 0 in the end, an emphatic victory and bragging rights to the top. The sporting moment after a match that was played in great spirit. The teams embrace, shake hands, and say, Well done on a good game, well played. A competitive match, a great match. Bragging rights to year 10, but most importantly, played in a brilliant spirit and a brilliant atmosphere. Well done, both teams. Was that bragging rights to year 10? But not too much bragging, yeah? Three now. Year 10 in the inaugural.